What's going on guys? It's Nate aka Snatch Packs here with a 21 OPC Platinum Blaster Box. Decided to open up a little bit of hockey. Haven't opened that up yet on the channel and I know I've had a few people requesting or asking if I do open some hockey. It's not really too much out there to grab unless you want to order it. So I decided to pick up a OPC Platinum Box probably one of the better blasters you can get you can hit autos number cards and some nice parallels so this is five cards in five packs four cards per pack and we'll jump right into it here with uh, my best hit out of the opc platinum this year i hit a out of a hobby it was a uh, number to 50 Krill Kaprizov Rookie Auto. Ended up flipping that for about 800 bucks, but now it's going for about 1900. But we'll save that story for another day. So, we've got a Blake Wheeler base, a Sunset, uh, Sam Reinhardt. We got uh, David Perron. Red Prism, 60 out of 199. Not the player you're looking for, but always nice hit, a nice number card. And a Mark Shifley base card. Jump into pack number two here. You got a Sergei Brubosky base. Looks to be a Morgan Riley rainbow. And then we hit a Philip Broberg neon yellow surge. So that is one of the blaster exclusives. It's a real nice card there. I'm a Flames fan, as you can see with the Joe McGinley auto patch over there. And we also got a marquee rookie, Connor McMichael. This Crosby card, I actually just picked that up this week. First Crosby auto I got, it's 21 out of 100. 0809 Trilogy, three star scripted swatches. Traded uh, a Lafreniere uh, photo variation young gun from the extended series for that. Pretty fair trade, both people on each end were happy, so can't complain too much there. We got a Bo Horvath base. We got a retro rookie, Connor Ingram. A Brock Nelson base. And a Shane Bowers base. Or no, that's a Shane Bowers marquee rookie. Wasn't even paying attention. We'll get into pack number four here. These are a quick little rip, 20 cards, but you have a good chance of hitting some nice stuff in here. I got a Jonathan Huberdeau base, a Sweet Selections, Timothy Lilligren, selected 17th overall four times, Toronto Maple Leafs since 1964. Toronto Maple Leafs head. And then we got a yellow Surge, Eric Carlson. It's a nice card there. And uh, Andre Svechnikov. Mr. Svechnikov. That's for my boys out there. They find that pretty funny when I do that. So Martin, Martin Cook or whatever his name is on Carolina does it better than I do, but... Thought I'd give that a little shot. We got a Blake Lazat, uh, base, a rainbow marquee rookie Keandre Miller, not the Ranger we were looking for. Then we got a base, Oli Julevi, marquee rookie, and the last car we have, yeah, baby, I PC him. So, Kale McCarr, Neon Yellow Surge. He and Drew McGinley are 
two of the guys that I PC mainly. I got a few nice cards on my cars. Love seeing the value go up on those, but overall, not a terrible box. No autos or anything like that. But a few nice hits there with the marquee rookie, Philip Broberg, Yellow Surge. I'll dig that one out. That there, not too bad. Then we also had the Red Prism, David Perron, Sunset, Sam Reinhardt, um, Timothy Lilgren, Sweet Selections, Neon Yellow Surge, Eric Carlson, and the Neon Surge, Kale McCarr. So overall, not a bad pack. Um, I'll definitely be doing more hockey in the near future. Hopefully, March 2nd, I'll be grabbing a few hobby boxes of Series 1, 21, 22. And I will do either one big pack opening where I rip a few boxes at once, or I'll break them up into separate videos. You guys can leave a comment down below what you think you would like better what would be more enjoyable to watch a few shorter videos or one real long video um but for now snatch packs out take care